Welcome to Technical Studies. Hemispherical dish heads are ideal for high pressure vessels due to its ability to withstand high pressure. This type of dish ends are most commonly used for mounted bullet tanks and LPG road tankers. In this video, I will show you how to lay out and mark a hemispherical dish head, this method is applicable for spherical tanks also. A hemispherical dish head has two parts. The petals. And the crown. Assume that, the dish end's diameter is, 3500 mm. The dish end will have a height of, 1750 mm, which is equal to, half of its diameter. Suppose the crown diameter is 2000 mm. Using Z as the center, draw a circle with a 3500 mm diameter. Draw a half circle as shown, and draw the crown line. Divide the petal side into four equal parts, as shown. Note down the arc lengths, 1 to 2, 2 to 3 etc. Name the intersection points 1 to 5 as shown. Draw perpendicular lines from points 1 to 5, intersecting the centilines of the top circle. Draw circles, ZA, ZB, ZC etc., on the center of the top circle as shown. Since the number of petals are 6, divide 360 degree by 6. Draw a line, ZV. The including angle shall be 60 degree. Note down the arc lengths of, AR to EV. We know all the arc lengths now. Let us mark it on a plate. Draw a line, 5, 5. And draw a vertical line, x, y. Draw parallel lines, 5, 5 to 1, 1. The distance between these lines shall be, as per the layout. Mark the measurements, AR, BS, CT, etc straight on the layout. Draw curves connecting the intersection points of these lines. Make a template as per the inside radius of the dish end and bend the plates. Thank you for watching. In the next video, I will show you how to assemble the petals and the crown.